A few years back, I immersed myself in volunteer work as a therapist at the local hospital. During this period, I was granted the privilege to provide Christian faith-based support to those seeking it. One particular encounter left an indelible mark on me, a man with a story so miraculous that it defied belief. This man, previously fit and healthy, employed in the construction industry, experienced an abrupt onset of dizzy spells and intense fatigue seemingly out of nowhere. Multiple doctor visits over several months culminated in a grim diagnosis, cancer. The prognosis was a daunting 50-50 chance of survival. As fate would have it, our paths crossed during his diagnosis and our discussions frequently revolved around matters of faith life after death, and God. In December 2015, he embraced Christ, and by May 2016, he was declared cancer-free. Reflecting on his journey, he shared with me his conviction that God allowed him to confront the specter of death to capture his attention. According to him, this life-altering experience was orchestrated by a higher power, paving the way for a new normal. In the wake of his healing, this man underwent a profound transformation. Once a womanizer, he became wholly devoted to his wife. His language, once tainted with profanity, underwent a radical shift as he now spoke about God and offered encouragement to those around him. The tough exterior he once projected gave way to a demeanor filled with love, extending warmth to colleagues and friends. His changed life became a beacon leading many from his workplace to embrace Christ after witnessing the undeniable difference in him. Attempting to understand why God chose to heal him and not others remains a mystery. Yet, the undeniable reality is that this man's life was radically altered, illustrating that God's plans often transcend our comprehension. Perhaps you find yourself in a situation where events seem incompatible with God's will. The idea that your current trials might be a necessary precursor to a divine transformation might be challenging to accept. Yet, consider the notion that God orchestrates change in our lives, creating a new normal through challenges and tribulations. In various facets of life, warnings are presented but often disregarded. Historical events such as the 2008 global financial crisis and the Titanic disaster exemplify instances where clear signs were ignored, leading to catastrophic consequences. In a broader context, warnings in the workplace, societal cautions, and even traffic rules underscore the importance of heeding advice. However, my aim today is to draw attention to five warnings from the Bible, often underestimated or dismissed. The first is the inescapable appointment mentioned in Hebrews chapter 9, verse 27, Every individual has two inevitable appointments, death and judgment. The Bible emphasizes that every careless word will be accounted for on the day of judgment. The second warning revolves around guarding the heart, as stated in Proverbs 4, verse 23. The heart, the center of one's being, requires vigilant protection against the enemy's infiltration. The plan of the adversary is to attack and corrupt the heart, leading individuals away from God. Humility is the focus of the third warning found in 1 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 12. The passage urges believers not to be overconfident as arrogance often precedes a fall. Acknowledging one's vulnerability is crucial in maintaining a humble and reliant stance before God. The fourth warning concerns the destructive power of the tongue, highlighted in Proverbs 6, verse 2. Words, akin to a powerful force, can either build or destroy. The Bible warns that individuals can be ensnared and taken captive by their own words, emphasizing the need for caution in speech. Lastly, the fifth warning underscores the influence of one's inner circle, as described in 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 33. Bad company is said to corrupt good morals, and the Bible cautions against associations that stir up conflict and division. Selecting companions who align with Christian values is essential for spiritual well-being. 
Reflecting on historical events and biblical warnings, it becomes evident that heeding advice and acknowledging warnings are essential for avoiding dire consequences. Applying these principles to our spiritual lives, recognizing the need for humility, guarding the heart, and choosing the right companions are paramount for a thriving Christian existence. The Bible warns against a lukewarm faith, urging believers to be either hot or cold. There is no room for divided loyalties or wavering commitment in the kingdom of God. James chapter 4 verse 8 encourages believers to draw near to God with purity of heart and hands, rejecting double-mindedness. Addressing the battle for the mind, 2 Corinthians chapter 10 verses 4 and 5 emphasizes the importance of taking every thought captive to the obedience of Christ. In a world filled with distractions and negative influences, guarding the mind against contamination is crucial. Immersing oneself in God's word becomes the antidote to counteract worldly influences and align thoughts with God's truth. The transformational power of a renewed mind is underscored by Colossians chapter 3 verses 1 to 4, urging believers to set their minds on things above. This involves a conscious decision to focus on eternal matters rather than succumbing to the temporal distractions of the world. By pursuing God's presence and seeking revival in the heart, believers can overcome double-mindedness and fix their gaze on Jesus. The final exhortation is to consider the power of words and thoughts in shaping one's reality. Proverbs 23 verse 7 declares, For as he thinks in his heart, so is he. Embracing the promises of God and aligning thoughts with his word empowers believers to walk in victory, peace, and faith. In conclusion, the call to a transformed life involves embracing a new normal shaped by God's truth. By heeding biblical warnings, guarding the heart, cultivating humility, and renewing the mind, believers can navigate the challenges of life with a focused and unwavering faith. The power of God's word becomes the guiding light, leading to a life that glorifies him in every aspect.